Hey guys, Wizard of the Coast made a very interesting announcement about Modern. And Modern is no longer going to be in the Pro Tour for next year. And the reasons they provided are met to me. So Ian Duke gave a few different reasons. He said the Pro Tour should be highlighting new cards that are released. And Standard is the best way to do so with the new 2 block shift. I have my concerns about that. A, Standard makes Wizards of the Coast the most money. Um, there's no argument about that. But it's the most expensive for players because you always have to make new decks. You always have to change the meta. And with the two block shift now that's happening, rotation happens 50% faster than it normally would. So for a Magic player being forced from Modern to Standard or in Modern you already had your deck, it's extremely, exceedingly painful. Uh, because the cost, um, the cost. If you build a modern deck, you should be able to play that affinity deck until the end of times. But now, there's really no promotion. So the second part I want to focus on is having the modern Pro Tour put more focus on the format and more pressure on Wizards of the Coast to make changes to the ban list for format diversity. This is probably the only point I will accept. Um, it does make a lot of sense, but it's not because Wizard of the Coast is trying to do a good job. It's because they failed so miserably in the past that to get rid of Wizard of the Coast from touching moderns actually just like what they did with Legacy, good because you know instead of trying to push off of the Gatewatch down everyone's decks, if you will, they don't have to do that anymore because they don't even need to worry about it, right? So Modern is safe because they don't care about it, if that makes any sense. Um, the more they care about Modern, the worse Modern becomes, which is a horrible, horrible thing to say, but it's true. Uh, the last argument they have is they originally had the Modern Pro Tour to help the format grow, so they never wanted it. And now the format is hugely successful and growing. The field, the format is no longer needs that support. Just like Legacy, uh, the problem with this argument is the crux of the argument relies on, hey, we only have so many pro tours. We have to promote product. We're going to promote only standard because this makes the most amount of money for us. We're not going to promote modern. But when people see modern decks and they get excited and they... You, it drives the players. So if you don't have a modern Pro Tour, that's why the players in 2015 were very upset when they announced that they didn't have one. Then they had to backtrack and add one in. It's just a whole a mess, absolute mess. Um, yeah, it's it's pretty bad. Magic does not make money. Wizards of the Coast does not make money if you don't buy packs. It's simple as that. And yeah, you can say, oh, modern masters packs and stuff like that. Yes. It should make sense for them to sell modern master packs. But remember, there's already a secondary market for that that competes with those packs. So yeah, they can sell a ton of packs, but not as many if the only way you can get Avacyn is if you buy a new pack. There's plenty of ways you can get Snapcaster. You can go on TCG Player, Card Kingdom. I mean, the stock of something like Snapcaster, even if reprinted, it exists out there. So they don't have control of that market. But they have 100% control of the new Avacyn market. They make a new Avacyn. It's pretty bay and it's just dominating. Guess what? You can buy a pack and open that. Um, and it's a lot harder to buy from your store. My store doesn't have any Avacyns anymore. So yeah, um... As a uh, modern player, as a previous legacy player, I find this news both good and bad. So leave me a comment below. Is this something that I'm overreacting to or is this just the death of modern? Because it kind of seems like it's going the way of legacy. So they cut the Pro Tours, they, they cut the GPs, and they cut their PTQs, and then suddenly no one cares about modern. Kind of like legacy. Thank you, Wizard of the Coast. Thank you.